be strong. Hello there guys. Welcome to Indian Short Tutorials. In this episode I'm going to teach you how you can uh, play multiplayer in VBA uh, like the Pokemon games on VBA multiplayer kind of thing in this PC and this is not the like the main method it's an alternative method so you have to click VBA link download I'm gonna give you the link in the description so then uh, click on the first link which is VBA link dot info and uh, as I said it is not the uh, VBA link LAN version it is for the single computer and this works for people like uh, for whom LAN version is not working like me it wasn't working for me so I got this method so click on the first one which is download VBA link 1.72 LAN edition so it's downloaded I have already downloaded it so uh, there's a download error over here see uh, it's uh, with the number two then I'm even gonna show you how to download the uh, Rome hacks in like uh, the next episode then go to downloads and I think it must be over here it will be over here somewhere oh yeah so this is the thing we be link once 1.72 LAN version then just double click it so you get all this kind of stuff then uh, I'm gonna make a new folder here okay VBA then just copy the, all these things into this and close that see like a uh, computer like mine uh, just skip this thing my computer is a bit laggy and it's still working on my computer so there shouldn't be any problem on yours just run and uh, another one too so you're gonna run two windows like this then uh, open your uh, room uh, it's gonna be over here my mine go here so it's fire red so I have already saved it like this okay what why did I do that okay. fire it and just open your room first I'm gonna open my room again over here too and where so oh, okay yeah. and open it over here too so we have two things side by side and one more thing I uh, forgot to mention is that if like if your second slide or even the first slide is not opening and just it's a blank screen then go to emulator save type and set it to flash 128k minus running smoothly so I don't need so you can do same on the either side as mine is working perfectly I, I don't need to just set it to flash 128k and then reset it one more thing is go to the emulator and see that pause when inactive window is not ticked so if it is ticked only once gonna work so others gonna be stopped so just untick it so that's unticked then just go to joypad and configure so one uh, the one joypad and two joypad so let me uh, quickly configure this Uh, man. I am about our family and uh, electronical gadgets. Okay, then it is going to be D. Delete. End. And I don't need that, so I'm going to keep something 9. Uh, something. Okay. Then for this, we are going to be keeping Q and E and T. Okay. That's all set. So let's check if uh, we have configured the first one. So I have al already configured the first one. So then after you have configured, default uh, joypad should be set to 2 on one of it. Not both, on only one. Then go to options, go to link and see that 
uh, it's on one computer over here then click OK then uh, where's this thing it's on one computer then just leave it now oh uh, I have already saved it like this like I click uh, clicked on save and I did that so I'm gonna open the first one in this and the second one in this so it's gonna get a little bit laggy but uh, it's not gonna be that laggy now what I'm gonna do is first move the first guy and talk to this lady over here you can even like fast forward it then just I I'm gonna trade now let's move the second guy over here and just let's talk to this lady okay we need trade center so yeah yes just click on that and wait a minute okay so we have saved the game okay So I think I have done some mistake. So let me just do it again. So yeah, that's over there. So I have to just uh, like re-click it. If it doesn't come, just go to options, link, and re-click the single computer one. So I have to click both of them at the same time. So yeah, okay, yeah, so as you can see, I'm entering in, and like, let's go over here, one is gonna go over there, then one is gonna go over there, so yeah, communication standby, please wait, so let's wait. Okay, now we have this thing over here, and you have to have two Pokemons in order to trade. So we have two Pokemons on one side, like the A one. Then just I'm gonna select this as a dummy. Uh, so I'm gonna select this as a dummy for now, and for this side, I'm gonna use the Bulbasaur because Beedrill is the worst choice for a starter and I kind of like did a only poison type challenge for like uh, passing time in this um, corona pandemic time so that's the thing and it was not uh, too hard as there are many poison types that are dual types which help a lot so yeah now as you can see the trading is complete i don't know about the f uh, like the battle one because i didn't try it yet so if you kind of want to try it you can go ahead and try and tell me in the comments if it kind of works for you because this is not a method that works for everyone it works on my windows 7 32 bit so i don't know if it, if it works on every pc or uh, windows so i uh, i can't assure you that this is the perfect method uh, like the other methods aren't working for me so i uh, brought this method for you and if you are uh, a guy like me 
who wants to play uh, with friends on a single PC but the methods are not working for you this tutorial is for you okay guys let's meet in the next episode goodbye